Okay, so I bought a project. No, 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 no. This ain't a project. This is a parts bike. It's a, I think he said it's a 04 LTZ 400. Uh, I don't, I didn't check it because I, I can tell what it's an LTZ because I have the same one. But anyway, he said this came from the police department. He said there was a bunch of them at the auction from the police department, so that's kind of interesting. But uh, anyway, uh, this is an extra motor. That should work with mine. Or I can sell it. It's obviously missing too much for me to even want to try to put it together. So I'm just going to use it as parts and sell the rest. These shocks are nice. I'll be using these for sure. Uh, but I got all kinds of extra parts. I know I need this rear master cylinder because the one on mine is dirty and won't pump. So, But uh, I'm going to get this thing unloaded and see what it's all about. Inspect everything. I don't know what this kind of rigging is going on here, but something's f***ed up. Uh, I definitely needed some wheels, so that's one of the main reasons I bought this whole thing, because by the time I bought a whole set of used wheels, it's going to probably cost around 200 anyway. And I got this whole thing for 200 so I mean, I'm not complaining. Got an extra switch up here. It's locked up, looks like. If this thing don't break on me, we'll be all good. I don't need ramps. Is it gonna break? The police officer's been doing burnouts on these tires. Oh my God. That crank is rusty. Yeah. The engine is no good, but I didn't buy it for the engine, so I don't really care. And I got extra covers and stuff, extra radiator, extra steering post, oil reservoir, cases, brake levers, brake pads. Oh yeah, it's got it all. Oh yes, I needed lug nuts too. Oh my god, they're all stripped off. I cannot believe this. I also need this overflow reservoir because on mine, there's a big crack and I JV welded it. So now I have this, so that say, that's 30 bucks right there. So uh, that's already something I can mark off the list to make it worth it. Let's see, if this CDI box is good, then that's worth a good bit. It's an OEM one you can tell by the Mitsubishi logo. Pretty sure that's the Mitsubishi logo. Uh, got a new rectifier. Uh, Looks like the whole harness is there, which is good. That's worth a little bit. It's got some cut wires up there. Uh, radiator hoses look to be usable. This thing sat outside for a while, you can tell. <laughs> look at that. How do you strip that out? Got the clutch cover off here, and boy, the water and mud sitting there for a long time. Good thing I didn't buy this thing for the engine. <laughs> Uh, but I'll probably end up selling the whole block in one piece, like transmission and everything, and I'll keep the side covers and sell those separately. And uh, yeah, I already know what parts I'm going to use. And then the rest, I'll probably end up selling on my eBay store. Uh, I might actually use these grips. They're actually in pretty decent condition. Put a little shine on them, they'll look brand new. That rear shock's in pretty good condition. I like the red shocks. And over here on the flywheel side, you can obviously tell a lot of water. You can tell the crank. I can feel the crank bearings are worn by doing that. And obviously I showed the crank. And uh, He showed that uh, there was rust in the motor in the pictures, so I obviously didn't buy it for the engine. I just knew that uh, there was more than $200 worth of parts on here, so I had to scoop it up. Especially since I uh, need a few of them, so... Whatever I don't use, I will sell and make money back. The CDI, I tested and it works. So that's probably 75 bucks back in my wallet. I needed a full set of lug nuts and guess what? Most of them are gone or stripped out, which really sucks. But the wheels don't seem to be wallowed out like my other ones were, so that's good. Uh, you can tell that they were painted, but I'll probably sand these down where these little 
uh, scratches are, sand them down and paint all of them black or something. Maybe get them powder coated. Because I do need a full set. Especially two rears. I do need that solenoid. I'm going to keep that probably for an extra one. I'll definitely keep that coolant reservoir too. Someone already took the radiator fan, which kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Rectifier, I'll have to test to see if that's good. I'm sure it is, because the CDI was good, so I doubt both of them are gone or are bad. Sprockets look to be in still usable condition. A little rusty, but well, that's pretty much it. I'm going to probably get this all stripped down, put it on the shelves, and start lifting items and keep what I keep. I will not make another video on this, most likely, so this is the last set. Uh, it'll probably be seen like this at least because next time it's seen if at all it'll be on the shelves but anyway guys thanks for watching the video leave a like if you did enjoy subscribe if you haven't already turn on post notifications so you get a notification every time i upload and i'll see you on the next video and peace out